All right, the ladies and gentlemen, John Sweet Pea here with which with what is probably quite a long overdue part 15 of my Dynasty Warriors 8 Extreme Legends Complete Edition playthrough of the Way Story campaign. I do apologize for the fact that it's taken me since the 9th of May to actually get this part out. I have been focusing a lot more on my live streaming as of late. However, this problem will soon be a thing of the past with regards to this series, which I will explain in a video coming up on this channel in the next day or so. That being said, let's get straight onto the comments made from last time. Um, Lewis Bork made the comment that in Dynasty Warriors 5, for this mission we're about to do, we can kill Guan Ping to prevent the water attack. Although he does say he hasn't played this map on Dynasty Warriors 8, he would imagine there'd be some way of preventing the water attack. Which is a pretty infamous part of the map we're about to do, so we'll, as I said to him, we shall see. Uh, N8 also made the comment about he missed the old Dynasty Warriors where he could unlock the items and the horses, as he feels the giant ones are awful. And I asked, apparently you can unlock some special horses in this game, but only Guan Yu and Wu will have the Red Hearse default horse in the story mode, as well as a few others, but everyone else has the generic terrible horse. However, you, have to, you can unlock some special horses in the ambition mode of the game, so, which is pretty good. Um, Andy Crimson Rain also mentioned that um, about, I think, Zhang He, about jump cancelling after charge attacks into air combos, and I think you can follow up Storm Rush with a Muzu as well. It has been a while since they've played this. We will have to see if we can test that out. Um, then there has been one or two comments mentioning that apparently this is to be the final part of the um, way storyline, apparently, in this. Um, apparently it's just to be the last story part for um, the way campaign, apparently, in terms of things. I mean... We are about to enter the Battle of Farn Castle, and I'm kind of surprised actually if this was to be the final battle, as I kind of thought we would probably end way at the Battle of the Wuzhang Plains with the showdown between Sima Yi and uh, Zuge Leon. But if this is to be the last stage, then so be it. I mean, we will have to see. Some people aren't, there isn't 100% certainty, but two commenters did mention this as the final fight. So we will hop straight in. And I pretty much know the story of this, so we will be skipping this story. Basically, Guan Yu has invaded Fan Castle, we're going to take it back from him, and we're going to enlist the help of Wu to do this. It's a pretty major point, actually, in the terms of the Three Kingdoms diplomacy, which we'll probably see a bit more of from the Wu and Shu perspectives later down the line. In the meantime, though, Wei is going to defend this castle from Guan Yu. A tall order, I would think. So, as usual, uh, everyone has voted for a character choice. Uh, Zhang Hindun did receive one vote, but there was some dislike towards using him. But he is not the pick for today. Who wrote his old brother Zhang Hu Wan received no votes at all. So it was a bit of a toss-up between Sao Pi and Zhu Huang. However, by a margin of five total votes, the winner is Sao Pi. We have played as before, and it was actually quite a formidable character, so it'll be very interesting to see. We need to remove that, I think. Yeah, I think we will. So right, defense, health, elemental, yeah, basic I should do it. Weapon-wise, we're using the same two. I think we have no upgrades here, but we will check. Yeah, pretty much just the same as before. We have one tier two weapon with his blade, and that's it. So we have his tier 2 clarity spike and the tier 1 iron edge, and that's about it. Really, with, of course, awareness being able to guard tanks attacks from behind, which is useful. And if the enemies will drop wing boots on the other weapon. So, without further ado, let us play off for the second time as the impressive Sao Pi and see how we hold up against Guan Yu at Fang Castle. Know that one day this entire land will be mine. Is raining. What's that? A coffin? That's just creepy. 
kinda looks to me like he's going to surrender. He's only new after all. He joined us at Tong Gate. Why is he carrying Wait, a coffin? Master Pung Du. What are you doing with that coffin on your back? Naturally, I have no plans to die. This is proof of my resolve. Sounds a bit like a younger Sal Cell. A warrior must fulfill his duty with no fear of death. <laughs> that is why. I keep this reminder of death close to me. Your spirit is impressive. Men, follow his lead. Only the brave and the defiant stand with us this day. The day we destroy the god of war, Guan Yu. I thought we might be getting an immediate start here. Happening with Fong Castle. Master Tsao Ren and Master Pong De are there. They should still be holding fast. But without our help, they won't last long. We need to hurry. Jing Province must not fall into the hands of Shu. Mm, I think we are getting an immediate start here. Yep, that's an in-game cut. Alright, so I'm just going to remind myself of what the EX move is, since I have forgotten. So, EX is combo 1 and combo 4. Okay, cool. And now this time we have our second Muzu attack, which I don't know if we had last time with Sal P. So, we should be doing good. So, we must defeat all the officers. Perhaps I would be better served by switching sides. Been a oh dear, this is not good. Prevent Eugene from us. Now if we do remember, Pong Day, uh, sorry, Sal P is basically the master of ice. Wow, this guy is blocking quite a bit. I'm gonna have to break his guard a bit. Oh boy. Wow. I'm actually hitting him for the other side of the wall. Maybe a while since I've played this game, but. Ooh. Better kill this guy quickly and go help you, Jin, I think. And that shall be the. Come on, horsey. Let's go assist him. Come on. Oh, what's going on here? The enemy are Whoa. We're actually floating on a horse. That's kind of cool. <laughs> We've never been able to do this before. Seriously. I've never ever been able to do that before. You can actually just fly in the water. Nice. That was quite well here. Ooh, I found that counter pretty well. See, we can combine it with a bit of ice power. So, it looks like mo oh wow, that was pretty well, and we have catapult attacks as well. That does not help. What? Seriously, dude? This is kind of annoying, actually. Have to kill this guy before the catapults come back. Not even fit to share the with me. Ow. Can you, like, die so I can get your items? Cheers, pal. So, after all that, Eugene defected. What a coward. Let's kill these jerks quickly. Oh, it's counting. 
Wukui, it doesn't take very long to get back into a Dynasty Warriors game after being absent for so long. He's trying to block, so it's up to me to break his guard. Hmm. How is Zua's defective? Why is everyone defecting? It's so depressing. Ooh, I had to counter that. Nice. Nice. Got him there, pretty good. This is the last target as well, so we need to get him. Should help so I've kind of both support, doesn't it, Mizu? I was trying to get my storm rush then. See what she did? Oh come on! Every time, man. This is this is getting annoying now, game. I just want to execute a storm rush for God's sake. Thank you. Please don't be an annoying final mission. Oh, skills increase. Good. Alright, good. Hmm. Okay. About time allow increased. Let's work together with Wei to defeat Guan Yu. Wow. Zhu Huang has been defeated. I kind of like the fact we can actually swim. Victory conditions have... Oh, great. Oh. Adios, my Leon. Oh wow, so many officers here. I don't think you're allowed to talk about the trails, dude. I'm with that fourth Muzu, it's so good. It's blocking again. I have to take him down. I need to kind of wrap this up quickly. Or Wu Meng dies. So let's get rid of this traitor. Pack him into the water. Damn right, you'll fall back. Ah, the traitorous Yu Jin. I think we'll have you executed for treason, pal. Can everyone please stop being in trouble? I'm a little busy trying to take care of our ex-officer here. <laughs> As he clips into the wall once again. Uh-oh, that's Muzu. Nice. Ghost did attack there. Oh, he's changing. Oh, we actually froze him. That was a pretty good time to do it as well. Mid-weapon change. Beautiful timing on the freeze there. He didn't, wasn't able to. Ch Alright, one more jerk. And hopefully, then the north will be safe. I love that freeze attack. It gives, it gives me so much chance to hit him. Then I can combo into my storm rush. And good night. I leave. Right. Now we can go and help Wu. At last. Uh, I do miss the days where I didn't have to do all the work. Actually, <laughs> that never happened. You've always had to do all the work in a Dynasty Warriors game. That's kind of the idea. I just remember the days when it wasn't so obvious. Anyway. Cool little wreckage here, by the way. This is a really cool visual for the map, seeing all this wrecked buildings and stuff. Really good job on making this uh, visually... Quite an interesting looking map, actually, I have to say. It's 
seems like the ice freezing is kind of semi-random when he does that second EX. Hmm. Oh yeah! I guess you were right, Crimson Rain. You can sort of go in straight into a Muzu-ish. See ya. Dude, hold up please. I'm on it. Okay, good. We got 60 minutes. So plenty of time really to deal with all this. Alright. Is that anyone almost dead? You're doing a lot better than your brother. I should perhaps take out the alternate Muzu here. Ow! Oh, here it is, the alternate Muzu attack. Wow, okay, I've had enough of these Ballista now. Oh, let me guess, we have to defeat this guy to turn him off. Wonderful. Should have known. Yeah, I'm going to have to go to Rage here because this is really... Oh, I actually ignore it in Rage. That's really good. I take the damage, but I don't get the knock back in Rage so I can kill this guy really quickly. Alright, you can stop it. I mean, I shouldn't have fallen with that. I will stop you. You will never reach my father. The southeastern garrison has been close shut. It is holding up the reinforcements. Come on. Move. Let's go deal with that, shall we? You rocks and shoot as the wolf force is in trouble. Defeat one Sue and Wei Yarn. Your target is Von Castle. Can we jump down here or something? The southeastern garrison has been discovered. Circling around to the high ground behind it should allow access. Oh, okay. Go around. Bang Day is isolated and in trouble. If we don't put a stop to the enemy we will suffer massive What should we do first then? Wow, this guy's getting freeze locked to death. I'm not going to engage the second we freeze on that. There's really no point, I'm going to have to trigger him out first. Get out of here, dude. Okay, open the gate, please. Right. Game. Oh, for God's sake. Fine, I'll fucking drop the rock attack. Jesus. Oh, wow. We've actually done something for once. That's handy. Please continue. Thank you. Oh, don't tell me I have to go over... Oh, this is annoying. I, that's the wall ground. Wait. Oh, that might. This might help. If I actually took the correct path, <laughs> it would help a lot. Wow, what are shields here? I didn't really want you to freeze him there, but whatever. Yeah, alright, we get it. Stop the rock attack. I get it. Yeah, it's taking a long time to come off his attack like that. 
Ooh, I actually knocked him off <laughs> before he got the chance to execute it. Ooh, nice damage there. Nice damage there, Shiva. Never have I been on the defensive like this. The enemy's resolve is impressive. Not for what you wonder it isn't. There's still much left to be done. I must retreat for now. Oh, is only temporarily withdrawing? Ooh, yes. Alright. Well done. I have enjoyed watching you fight. I hope you did. Does that stop the attacks now? I trust that's the end of the attacks, right? Yeah, it looks like that's it. We've stopped the attacks because we've disabled uh, Guanzing, so now we just have to... Uh, and it appears that I fucked up because apparently there was a high ground attack I could have taken. Which surprisingly the others managed to get to quite comfortably, but I seem to have ignored. Um okay. I assume we just jump off here. This will be my concern, yes. No. Okay, game, and where the hell did they come from? Seriously, I'm trying to get into that spot right now, and I, I'm pretty sure I went round. Unless I did, I fuck up somewhere. So this is the extent of my abilities. I'd like to help you, but for some reason I seem to keep. Oh, the gate's open now. Okay, good. Now we can help them out. Let's go. Oh God damn! Let's go down. And so we're helping Wu. We were helping us after all. Ah, oh, the sight of Wu and Wei working together. A worst sight you'll ever see. Past the early stages, anyway. I can't give up yet. Alright. Okay, template withdrawing, good. Now we can perhaps make some ground somewhere along the line. Now, head for Fawn Castle. We shall bring an end to this battle. Oh no, I think we're gonna have to head out there, aren't we? Oh. Castle. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Um, I assume we can go this way, can we? Uh, I well, yeah, it looks like we can. Just about get under there. It's kind of cool actually that the water doesn't stop horses anymore. This is a really nice touch. Also, that the horses can actually swim. Oh, Guan Ping! I'd rather word with you. You are a fool to come out here alone. You shall fall prey to my dice. Oh, a diamond freeze, that's good. What a magnificent fight. I am glad you're not my enemy. It seems that I was not nearly as well prepared as I thought. Oh man. Oh, at least he took a while to go down. Oh, I need to change my weapon out once again. Alright, we gotta focus on Guan Ping. He's the one that needs to be defeated, not the other guy. That was annoying. Oh, give it a rest. Not even fit to share the battle with me. Man, this guy is persistent. Oh good, I froze him just at the critical time. Yeah, you're definitely right. You can chain that 
Muzu into a Ah, oh, blast. Look at that. Capture the Southern Garrison and... Uh-oh, Hong Zhuang's here. Oh, it's like... So once again, we will swim across the water. Which is actually quite a fun mission so far, I have to say. It really does kind of feel like a turning. If this was to be the final mission, this would not be a bad place to have it. I'm going to ignore that fight, even though I should assist them, because morale is... Well, we've already lost too many, and it's time to speed this up a bit, so... Quite a good map to come back to, actually, after my several months' absence on this series. Uh, I'll start to pick out the Gatekeeper. I think I'll save the Muzo if possible. Oh, come on. The morale isn't that cripplingly bad. Wow, one dong went straight for me. I'm flattered. Oh, what? Gonna secure the kill here, I think. Whoa, he actually managed to not die from that. And he's on a postcard, so... Ooh, that double attack will definitely be useful. Just a moment. Easy time! Skills in... Nice. Oh yeah, he's got a superior weaponry. And I have superior counters. Wow. Oh, now my Chow wants to join the party, it seems. Didn't we in shoot the Mount Ding Jun, Hawang Zong? Alright, you want to do that? Ow! Got some archers somewhere backing him up. Can't actually tell if he's supposed to be firing or just defending. It's posed. Oh, we froze him. Ah, we're going on a weakness now. Come on. Keep him on there. That weapon type, if possible. We have to move over here to counter his. Damn straight. Nice. I have enjoyed watching you fight. Oh, I'll take out this guy while we're here. Let's kill this guy real quick, so our rear guard is secure. I don't. I didn't fancy getting hit by Huang Zong's arrows. Nice timing, Zhaohundun. Some damage there. Got him. Nice. Got that. Not even fit to share the battlefield with me. That's good. That's good. Come on. Come on. Horsey. Hey, there's the ram. Quite sure what was a. Hmm. These must be the. I guess these rams will eventually destroy the. Uh, everything. Might as well kill off as. Although you'd be all shy now. I'm gonna take this guy out. He's already wounded. Nice. 
Nice. That ultimate Muzu attack's pretty good. Easy victory. Come on, horse. Let's go. What's left to do then? I guess we are going to have to go and kill off the middle area? Yeah, it looks like that's all that's left to do. Now I'll try and resummon it. May have to get a teleporting horse in here if we're going to keep going this way. But two of the rams are in position, so I assume we just got to get the third one. Up there. I tried to switch into my alternate Muzu then, but it doesn't seem to work with the uh, Muzu attack 2. Only the first one you can do the quick swap, it seems. Wow, what a fail that was. He actually got knocked out of my Storm Rush somehow. Oh well. Still dead anyway. Not even fit to share the battlefield with me. Nice. So I guess that's it, is there? Can't be much left now, surely. What is left to kill? I'm a Hmm, there's still quite a few out there, granted, but most of the main targets seem to be down. So, what am I supposed to be accomplishing here? Hmm. I know it said something about the rams. Are we supposed to help the rams with the gate or something? Because I've actually killed everyone else. And now I just feel like an idiot for not sort of knowing what to do next. Ah, finally. Okay, good. So the Rams just need a bit of time to destroy the checkpoints. And now we charge in and finish Guan Yu off. With the help of Wu's siege technology. It would seem. Looks like we're going to have to go through Ma Chao first, though. I'm sure... Uh, Wong Yi would love another shot at him. There's Guan Yu. I shall not let you draw any closer to my father. I will stop you with every last bit of strength within me. Oh wow. This guy is persistent. And again, he is Guan Yu's he is Guan Yu's this time we shall not be defeated. I will not Fox Sun, so I'm not surprised. As is this guy. Guan Ping and Guan So are both his sons. I knew Guan Ping was, but the other one is a mystery to me. I'm sure we'll get more acquainted on the shoe side things for them. Ooh, I got Max Muzu Charge. And Rage. Who the heck is this? Guan Yong Ping. Female? A daughter as well. Dang, you've been keeping busy, Guan Yu, I see. Two sons, a daughter. And now we... Guan Su, Guan Ping, that female. Goodbye, Guan Xin. Ultra, 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 Ultra... Just watch it. Adios. Something about Wuzu said something important there, but I was too busy killing things to hear him. Level up. Nice. Wow. Tone down the damage, Ombre. Ah, turn down the stone. Well, she's already dead. Wow, he did a lot of damage there. 
What happened to that girl? Did she get killed and all that? One young ping, I think her name was. Damn, why are you sure that what a time to raise a family? Two sons, daughter? I taught them all in the art of war. Pretty impressive, Guan Yu. Pretty impressive, gotta say. It's one military family. I look forward to getting acquainted with them all in the shoot campaign later down the line. Yeah, I think we defeated the girl as well. But, uh, I think. Yeah, just Guan Yu now. Yes, let's. Ice versus flaming red fire. And lots of numbers. Wow, I absolutely botched that up. Big time. He is in glowing red mode, so I need to be careful. He also has a lot of health. Or defense. Bit of both, really, I'd imagine. Come on. Let's get the Storm Rush combo into a good spot. Where I can actually capitalize. I am doing no damage to him at all. But this is the God of War. And he's going to take a lot of pummeling to see sense. Look, it, it isn't a chance to change his weapon yet, so I can keep following him forever. Come on, Guan Yu. Go down. Got him. I regret that my vow to my sworn brothers will go unfulfilled, but there is no shame in being defeated by you. Shaho Dun, say farewell to Lord Cao Cao for me. Hm. Brother, I go on. Ahead of you! What the fuck? Finally, I can see a light beyond the chaos. Did Guan Yu just commend his spirit up to the heavens or something? Known throughout the land as the god of war, Guan Yu fell at Von Castle. He was a great warrior that had once fought along Cao Cao as a guest officer. While he acknowledged the victory, Cao Cao could not help but lament the loss of such a formidable warrior. Afterwards, Cao Cao awarded Wu with Jing Province in recognition of their contribution to the joint attack. With this move, Cao Cao and Sun Quan split the land into north and south between them. Meanwhile, Wu Bei was furious over the death of Guan Yu and plotted revenge against Cao Cao from his position in the west. Cao Cao of Wei, Sun Quan of Wu, and Wu Bei of Shu. The formation of three kingdoms had been established and the struggle between them continued. Cao Cao contemplated the end game of the situation and worked to realize his ideals for the land. People shaped the era they lived in, and in turn, that era would shape future wars via something I missed. Having walked this path, Cao Cao was a man who could bring great change to the current era. Indeed, he was prepared to become a shining star amongst the pages of history as well. Oh, Zhu Chu, you'll never stop being adorable. So, Guan Yu is no more. Son, 
You will succeed me, will you not? Father, just what has brought this on? Guan Yu's death signals that we have reached the end of an era. The era of myself. Of Guan Yu. Of Yuan Shao. It was an era in which true men struggled for supremacy. I am sure that I, and likely Liu Bei too, will soon be called to join them. Must go on. Ooh, Sima Yi and Senji in the background there. Lead this land to the future. It deserves. Damn, Senji's looking good. So the way, hmm, Sun Quan of Wu. I can see it now. The next generation. I can see you fighting bravely, driving the land forward. Listen, my son. You must move on and create a better future. Create a new age and lead this land there. Interesting. That was quite the speech. Okay, and this brings us back to the title screen again. And now the story is complete. And that's it. All the stages are done. From the scapegoat Wu Yang to the Huao Gate. As his name, Yu Jin and Wei Dian. To Yan Province, to Zhu Province, Imperial Escort, Battle of Wang Castle, and the Battle of Zai Pi, which I also participated in. 
Battle of Gwondu. Gyaojia, that was it. That was, a, that was a name I had in mind, but I had him being for Jazu. So I got him mixed up. And then the Battle of Bainong, Zinyi, Chidi, Tongate, Heifei, Mountain Jun, and Farm Castle. Let's green Pond Day before he retreats will enable him to be present for the battle's victory. Oh, that's cool. So we can see some of the stars here that we could have done. We actually achieved a few of the stars on the way, which is good. Like the Giao Jia continued appearance. And uh, we also want Battle of Zai Pi due to that. It's only really, it looks like there's only really uh, two routes we could have alternated. Um, completing all the conditions will open up the hypothetical route. So we actually took the historical route, but it seems an alternate hypothetical route that we could have taken. Which I assume might be interesting to take a look at, actually, if we can unlock it. And it seems the other thing we could change was the Battle of Zhu Province is de quickly defeating Tao Qian. So there's an extra stage we could take a look at, as well as an extra route at the Battle of Chi Bei. So the historical route, which we ended up taking. So, kind of interesting there. And I did say that I would take a look at the alternate routes of uh, each faction in this playthrough. But I will discuss more about that in the upcoming video I'm going to be making about the future of this channel. But anyway, that's the entire Way initial playthrough. And of course there's still the uh, Extreme Legends content stuff, which will be done at some point as well after we do all these optional things. So... Still have many factions to go, not forgetting the fact the new boy is Jin, which we'll be covering last. Those the others and we will. So, that is it for the Way historical campaign. What did you all think of Way's <clears throat> uh campaign historical campaign route? Did you find it interesting? What were your highlights? What were the wallites? Which was your favourite character to see? Um, personally, I'm kind of impressed with how Sal P's played in-game. He was a pretty good character to play as, as was um, Gao Jia with his uh, snooker Q attacks. That was pretty cool as well. And it was pretty cool to meet a few new faces and uh, see battles from a slightly different perspective somewhat. But overall, I've actually quite enjoyed playing this game uh, so far. Dynasty Warriors 8 seems to be a nice improvement. Definitely sometimes feels like the older games, but has its own identity. It's been fun to play so far, and I look forward to seeing the new characters in the other modes. I'm particularly interested to see the perspective of some of those way battles for the next faction in the future. So yeah, let me know any of your thoughts in the comments below, and I will catch you all next time when, in some capacity, I will be taking a look at the hypothetical options for Wei, including the Battle of Zhu Province's alternate stage, as well as the hypothetical route unlock for the Battle of Chibi, since these seem, these seem to be the only two things in the main campaign that we have to take care of. But I'll explain more of that in the video. Anyway, thank you for watching. Catch you all next time. I'm sorry it took me this long to finally finish Wei's main story mode.